so the horses are helping me uh change my light up here this thing stopped working a while ago and i just pulled the freaking wires off look at how my ground wire is connected i mean they literally just kind of wrapped a wire around a, a glide wire i was like are you freaking kidding me i mean i'm, <laughs> I'm like holy cow <laughs> Oh, well, I'm pulling off and redoing. That's how, when you never know how someone wires something, they just twisted wires. And, uh, I mean, it's just freaking crazy. Anyway, let me disconnect this shit. <laughs> crazy. Okay, so these guys are still standing here helping me. Am I doing it right? I am? Thanks, buddy. Okay, so, uh... I just put a wire nut on these to kind of close them, but I wanted to make sure because this is on a light switch on if my light was working. So I wanted to uh, test this. Oh, there's a little light. See the light trigger? So I know when a switch is on that I'm getting power. And now I'll just, uh, I should probably turn the power off. I'm just gonna put that little wire nut on there. So that'll stay on there until I order. <sighs> okay, so now I have the wire nut separated. And uh, I'm gonna order me a new light. I just wanna make sure this light was working because of um, the light switch out here is over here. And it used to get water behind it. I kinda cocked it up because it was just sticking out here with water falling from a roof. So I put some caulk around it, but because it's not really a, what I would call a weatherproof socket, I didn't know if it was the problem. I should probably pull that off and maybe fix it, but. If it works, it works. All right, so I'll see when the new light comes in and we'll put that up there. Just so you uh, kind of get all this other crap out of the way. Uh, this is what the lights look like before. So I didn't have the lights for it and these things are really expensive and they burn out. So unless somebody can give me a good idea on how I can repurpose this or what for, it's probably gonna get trashed. Uh, I still think I, the wires are good, but those little tubes, glass tubes are expensive. Hi, you're handsome. <laughs> so I finally got that thing put up there. Uh, I finished it, I put a whole bunch of caulk around it. This wood is kind of, this house is kind of like falling apart and it's pretty old. So I just wanted to put a good gooping around there so water doesn't get in there. Even if water gets in, I like it's gonna hurt it that much. So uh, light switch is here. I didn't put this here, this was already here. I just kinda, this didn't have any goop at all and all this water used to run straight down here. I was like, dude, you put a light switch out? Anyway, the wiring. <laughs> so I just put some goop around it and you know what, it works. So when I turn it on, I have light. When I turn it off, I have no light. So uh, that little project's done. I think that light on Amazon cost me, um, I want to say 3,000 lumens and maybe 19 or 20 bucks. It's pretty bright even in the, uh, in the daytime. So at night, I think it's going to be pretty good. All right, pulling out there. Thanks for your help, little ransom. Like, whatever, dude. Give me a carrot. <laughs>